so basically uh, uh, more than um, uh, healing i uh, we discussed in the last webinar about uh, how to grow with inspiration yes um would, would you uh, uh, help us understand that uh, more in uh, because uh, it's a common um, uh, understanding if you are in school you are uh, facing the competition uh, if you if you want to get into uh, medicine if you want to get into engineering you again um, have to uh, compete with your uh, fellow mates and it goes on uh, you are in a company there uh, if you want to get promoted there is again competition so in reality when there is so much competition uh, how can we grow with inspiration you know what mujib uh, competition is based on the concept of lack okay and so the basic premise is, is lack it it just begins like this you know that the mother wants to feed the child the child is not attentive enough and we play a stupid prank like you know, come on to any otherwise so will take the little food or your elder brother will or stuff like that we create such um, experiences of lack and we create the scarcity the success becomes scarce and don't come on you go faster otherwise you will not get there uh, so the whole premise is, is lack unachievable difficulties struggle and uh, we picked up those uh, value and that's why you travel on the road which is more traveled so if you do not travel on the road which is so badly traveled in the sense which is so congested you do not have to compete you have to however take a chance a risk with confidence to travel on the road less traveled because you want to go where everybody is going because you want to do what everybody is doing because you want to behave the way everybody is behaving because you want to achieve what everybody wants to achieve you land up getting really steep competition however if you figure out what's meant for me there is a unique road available for you a unique path a unique goal a unique experience perhaps you have no need to compete and that can only happen if you can recognize what's meant for you did i answer your question so how do i find out what is my unique position or my yes, unique sir. role hmm okay so um, what i feel varsha there would be something that you're doing which makes you feel great Uh, at all levels of your being emotionally physically um, you know there's a sense of peace there's a sense of joy there's a sense of um, feeling good about yourself for everything at all levels have you experienced those moments it comes with radical yeah how does that feel it fulfills me actually at all chakra levels Awesome. Probably that's meant at the moment. However, when you try to do what others are doing, it may not be so fulfilling for you. And it may not be a particular thing. You know, it could be. just eating what you want to eat rather than what is prevalent and fashionable it could be wearing what you feel like wearing rather than uh, wearing what everybody does it could be you know enjoying what you exclusively enjoy rather than enjoying what everybody thinks that that should be enjoyed you know several things we do just because everybody does and you think that that's what the joy is in the house but if in reality very few of us really enjoy that uh oh. yeah sorry sorry to interrupt uh, uh is the atman's voice audible some people on the group uh, just message that uh, it's not audible are you able to hear uh, guys loud and clear 
Yeah, now I have been I am able to hear. There was some button on the left side of my phone, hmm. so I had to actually switch it off for it to be on again. So okay. maybe you guys can just check if it works for you. Thank you so much for the feedback. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I know it's a, it's a little uh, little bit of a challenge. It it stirs you up at times because uh, being competitive has been the part of growing up and part of our current existence. And yet I invite all of you to examine the possibility of enjoying life in a unique way. <laughs>